Good afternoon. I have some good news for you. The last time that I came to you with a video, we were talking about how you could watch athletic events using the Maroon Devil Network and joining and then paying $30. Uh, we've revisited that idea, and in this day and age of constant change, we're going to change it so that you don't have to join anything. All you have to do is subscribe to the Maroon Devil Network. If you're already a subscriber to the Maroon Devil Network, all of these athletic events are yours to watch free of cost. We're going to do that because we just really want to be able to, to kind of overcome some of the negative feelings that have come out of this, this COVID life, particularly where education is concerned. So if you have not subscribed to the Maroon Devil Network yet, I encourage you to do that. Just go into YouTube and you can, you can search for it and find it. And then you will be able to see all of our volleyball and as, as much cross country as we can bring to you. And as the other sports seasons open up, you'll be able to see more and more. And, and my promise to you is we're going to bring every single event home or away to you that we possibly can. Um, I think that's exciting. And that kind of uh, makes me feel better about today that has been exciting, but not in a real positive way. Because just a little while ago, I had to make a decision in conjunction with our school board and some other people to close Bright Adventures to face-to-face -face instruction until after Thanksgiving. Now the reasons for that have to do with the, with the fact that, that at this particular facility we have a ratio of um, teacher assistants and teachers to students that we have to maintain. And because of some COVID concerns, uh, we were not able to guarantee that ratio or even meet that ratio for quite a while. Now it's true that we had a couple of COVID positives here. I want you to understand that those COVID positive cases um, in no way became close contacts for any of our students. Now you're gonna ask, how is that true? That's because students are moving all the time. And the rules say that if you have 15 cumulative minutes inside of six feet, then it becomes a, a, a close contact. That hadn't happened with any students. Um, it did impact some other staff members as they were working on, on some projects. And then there were also some issues that um, not too unlike other days came from outside of the school system. But the long and short of it is this, we just didn't have enough staff to keep this open and it's gonna take for us a few days to, to overcome that. So all of our um, Pre-K students are now going to be remote and uh, Trisha Chapman, who is the director here, and her staff are going to be in contact with you if you have a child here and they're going to help you get started up on that remote piece kind of like we were back in the spring, but probably with more gusto. Man, I really, really hated making that decision today. I just, one of the things that I have tried to do and we have tried to do as a school system is to get as many kids into the buildings as we possibly can because I know that's where the best education occurs. Um, but at this time we just couldn't. So uh, I hope you understand that our goal is to keep everybody safe, to keep everybody healthy from our students to our staff. And this decision was necessary. Uh, let's just all do our part. Let's make sure that we, that we wait six feet from each other, that we wear a mask and that we wash our hands regularly so that we can minimize the impact of the COVID spread in Swain County and in other places as well. My hope is that this won't happen in any other place in our school system. That's what we're going to try to do. Hey, listen, if you, if you want to talk to us about this or if you have any other concerns, you can always contact me by email or call or, or talk to one of the principals or someone, um, and we'll do our best to help you out. But please understand, we're doing our best to take care of all of our kids. And we're doing that because we are part of your family. And I appreciate that. Thank you for letting us be part of your family. And thank you for being part of our Swain family. So until the next time that we're together, and I hope that we have more good news, just like all you have to do is subscribe. And now you get to watch all of the athletic events for free. What a great opportunity. I hope we have more of those coming your way. So until then, uh, please remember, I really do pray for you daily. God bless you, and uh, you have a great day.